Alright, so today we will be taking a look at the AAT, the Armored Assault Tank, and the piece count is 286 pieces, and it has four minifigures. Uh, two of the minifigures are battle droids, the same color steam, s scheme. One of them is the AAT driver, and one of them Lego just lists as a normal battle droid. We also come with Ahsoka's clone trooper or a 332nd trooper. Uh, they come with the clone trooper comes with a black gun. The battle droids come with the same gun actually, just cast it in I think like a chrome, not chrome, but like a gun, gun metal gray. And everything on this guy is the same with the 501st clone trooper, except for the helmet. You got the new face, the new clone face. Detailed legs and torso, detailed back, uh, but with the helmet, it's made to look like Ahsoka's markings that she has on her face, and it's the same orange, and um, yeah, it's a very cool minifigure, and uh, Ahsoka has, uh, has uh, two lightsabers, same ones. Uh, she comes with her mantles, which I believe what they are called. This is kind of rubbery. Not rubbery, uh, I don't know, like plastic. It comes in. Uh, and then she has a sm like a smirking face. And then she has an angry face, which are both highly detailed. And uh, she has some nice detail. Her back, nice detail. And her torso and her legs. Now we put that back on. She has some printing on her mantras. And now let's take a look at the main build. Alright, so you have a turret on the top. Like you, you can move up and down. You can rotate the whole thing 360 degree. The turret is a bit long, it's very big, I have some antennas up here, uh, and then you have this hatch up here, which you can open, if you grab the battle droid, you could fit up in there, you can pose them, but it's very hard to get the battle droid since they're on like a hinge for their waist, it's very hard to clip in because they just bend but there we go I got it and then boom you can have them like that now you come with two other turrets on the side uh, that can also rotate they can't move down fully but they can go all the way back to there um, and then you can open this part up to reveal control panels which are very nicely printed and you could fit your mini your battle droid in there oh, let me it's a pilot in I guess you could say uh, you have some sticker details on this on these there and then these actually activate your well shoot out your spring-loaded shooters that you have there, so if we have that, you can load it back in, but you gotta fold that up so that it's not in the way, uh, and yeah, that's it for this set, um, this is a pretty good set, I would say, for $30, I believe, and, um, it's just a very good build. You get two really uh, good, well, great minifigures. I feel like these should be shorter, though. These mantras. Um, the battle droids. Well, they're battle droids. You can't expect too much out of them. But, um, I feel like they go great with the 501st Battle Pack. But I wish there were more Clone Wars sets from this wave. From the 2020 wave and hopefully in 2022 we get more but 
that's it. Uh, I'd recommend this if you see it in stores, I'll buy it. And uh, yeah.